Hello and welcome to MG Tracy. It's Paul today here in London and over the years we've had a look at some of the great part works, the magazines that build up week by week or bi-weekly or monthly in some cases. So you have a magazine on one hand and you end up with something you've built on the other hand. Now traditionally these have been build a pirate ship, build a replica of a steam train, this sort of thing. So I think this one that's just been launched now, build a 3D printer really moves the genre on somewhat. So uh, let's have a look at what you get here. This is something very different. I think everyone's excited about 3D printing. It's something that's set to change our life over the next few years from making car parts, or even uh, metal 3D printers now, to making parts to replace our own body. So uh, even though I guess this one makes little plastic toys and things, or chess pieces, I still think that's uh, amazing technology. So this is the front here. Issue one is one ninety nine. Um, I'm guessing future issues will be eight ninety nine. That's the general sort of price part work things are. And what I always say, although these may be absolutely wonderful, just have a good look at what the total price of this is. If there's a hundred uh, issues and it's nine quid, obviously it's nine hundred pound. If it's more issues than that, etc., etc., then you need to have a little look and make sure you can afford. All of it. I don't think having half a 3D printer would be particularly useful. So uh, it says here, be among the first to build and own at home 3D printer, exclusively designed by Sebastian Conran. The Vector 3 printer is a sleek, state-of-the-art 3D printer that's easy to build and use, and could transform your life. Maybe. Virtually anything that fits the print area can be designed and printed as a physical 3D object. So it says that it explains about 3D printing, the world and how it's changing things about issue two. Has the next pieces of it. And a bit about Sebastian Conrad. So I'll have a little look inside. So now we've got an overview of the really impressive machine that people are going to be building with this. If it's easy assembly, that's always handy, I think, isn't it? The spec of the printer there works with PC or Mac. That one's a bit of an overview there. It's uh, the extra bits you get if you subscribe direct, so you get the obligatory binder, the toolkit there. A flash drive, 4 gig flash drive, filament, 10 exclusive special designs to make a whistle and balls and things, and you get digital uh, edition. Oops, oh, there you go, get the digital, digital edition of the magazine as well. So, inside the magazine, here we go. All about the 3D print revolution. And 3D printers are even now big enough to make sort of overall car designs at almost life size. So uh, I don't think everyone's quite tweaked just how big this is. I was in Harrods a few weeks ago and I could see they, even they were selling a range of 3D printers and had some of the things that were printed there that you could uh, have a touchy feel and have a look at. <coughs> Excuse me. So there you are, another list of the bits if you subscribe. <coughs> oh look, there's some of the things you can make with this printer. From cups to rocket ships, balls, chess pieces. It's a very trendy bracelet. Certainly a very, very useful thing to have once you put it together. About 3D scanning, so you can copy stuff basically. Scan it in instructions on what to do with your parts, how to be inspired, make your own chest set, isn't that truly amazing? Make a working whistle. Oh, make a catapult, wow, some great things here. And if you want to reserve it, get your news agents. You have your little reserve, your copy today. There's a competition. Get yourself 3D printed. It's always nice, isn't it, to have another reserve of yourself in case anything went wrong with you. 
that's a bit more about what comes with your shoe too. Shaft, shaft fixing base, nuts and screws. So I think that really, really is something a bit different, very exciting. Um, I'll leave the links below if this is a magazine you'd like to get hold of. Um, it's in the UK at the moment, um, but I guess it's available around the world. So that's fantastic. So that's uh, Paul saying cheerio from MG Tracy. Uh, please share, like and subscribe if you've got the time. That will be fantastic. And we'll see you next time. Cheerio.